Let's take a look at this problem. <clears throat> the natural log of x minus 3 squared, square root of x minus 7, all over 4 times x plus 1 to the fifth. Now to begin with, we can get rid of that square root. We can write it as x minus 7 to the 1 half power. Now the um, where we get that from is whatever number is in the slot right here, that's your index. If there is no number, it's by default 2, and that's what goes down your denominator of this fraction. And then you put 1 up on top, and whatever's inside the radical just comes straight down to the parentheses here. Okay, now we got a lot of different things going on here. We got second power, one half power, fifth power, we got multiplication, we got division. But the main thing happening is division. We got something up on top divided by something on the bottom. Well, division becomes subtraction. So we're going to have ln of x minus 3 squared, x minus 7 to the 1 half, <coughs> minus uh, ln 4 times x plus 1 to the fifth. Now notice these are natural logs. Um, it doesn't matter if we're talking about whatever base. Uh, this is base E. These properties still hold true. Now look at what's inside the first bracket here. Got second power, got one half power, got multiplication. Now when I say what's the main thing is happening, we can't say the second power unless everything's being raised to the second power. Well, only this is being raised to the second power. Only this is being raised to one half power. So the main thing that's happening is multiplication. We got this times this. Well, multiplication becomes addition. So we're going to have natural log x minus 3 squared plus ln x minus 7 to the 1 half minus, and then I'll put a parenthesis here, this minus has to affect everything that follows it. And over in this bracket, the main thing that's happening is multiplication again. We got 4 times x plus 1 to the 5th. So um, multiplication becomes addition. So we'll have ln of 4 plus natural log of x plus 1 to the 5th. Now remember, a negative out in front of your parentheses is going to flip the sign of everything inside. So on our next step, we got powers. We know we can put the powers out in front of the logs. So this becomes 2 natural log of x minus 3 plus 1 half ln x minus 7. This negative is a flip sign of this natural log of 4, so that becomes minus ln 4. And this sign will flip also, and it has a power. So that 5 goes out in front, and we change the sign out in front, so that becomes a negative 5 natural log of x plus 1. Now, we'd like to get the variable by itself, just like have natural log of x, um, but we have no property that allows us to split this up further. So that's as close as we're going to get. And this number here we can't do anything with. Our base is e. There's no way we can rewrite 4 as e to a power. So that's our answer.